yeah so guys uh this is our training on uh upwork so here's the continuation to the upwork training so now after we finish setting up our account on upwork so you have to complete your profile your profile completion should be 100 percent after you submit your portfolio and other stuff so like this so your account should be able to display in this format so your account should be able to display in this format So yeah, your account should be in this format. It should be displayed like this. So now, uh, I've come. I've added some uh, certification. Uh, my employment history. So it it doesn't have to be a company you work with. Maybe based on your employment history. You can have other freelance sites you've worked on before as your employment history. So another experience, you can add another experience as well. I didn't add it here, so I'll add it later. So uh, as you can see my certification testimonial. Testimonials are uh, 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 clients showcasing your strengths, how you performed when in your previous project. So testimonials as well help your cards to grow. So you can request a testimonial from a from a uh, a buyer that ordered you and he has the buyer that has left you a review then you can uh request for the buyer's email to request the testimonial so these are the requests of testimonial look like so let me open it so there, these are the testimonial request look like so the first name and last name of the buyer the business email address the client's linkedin profile the title project type and the description message to the client for requesting the testimonial so after you do that then you send the testimonial request so that's how it goes in such way so that's that about the testimony as you can see on this account i've completed three uh projects uh literally the project is two one is in progress because one project is a milestone project which hasn't to be paid completely so which makes it make uh, it makes it two two projects so I've, I've gotten two reviews from my previous buyers so uh, i've completed two projects and one is in progress because of its milestone so these are my account is is uh, my account is my profile is now another thing is this blue badge the blue badge is your identity once you verify your identity you'll be given that blue badge once you verify your identity you'll be given the blue badge so now let me let me move to the uh the new account i was creating so that i can show you how you set up some things there your profile your profile should be able to be set up and others so uh, let's move back to so yeah upwork so as you can see this account is 40 percent complete 40 percent complete so let's finish this setup and see how it is so i was asked to add my employment history so let me just add my employment history let me add those uh certification and i'll be back in a minute so everything must be added once you add everything sorry so once you add everything it should be 100 percent complete so i'll be uh pausing this video 
for a moment to add those details then after adding all these details i will you will see how my account is 100 percent complete so let me pause the video and add later um now the profile is 100 percent completed as you can see 100 percent completed so As you can see, the profile is completed 100%. So this is how you set up your profile to make it complete 100%. And this is what I added to make the profile completed. So uh, I I add my portfolio, make it at least two for portfolio. You added. So now the next thing is your certification. Make sure it is two certification you added as well. So your employment is to make it two as well. I choose. Five hours my employment history and help work as my employment history so once you're able to add those things then your profile will be completed 100 percent make sure you add your education level as well this is where you add it on the right hand side here uh left hand side here so yeah this is the education so you just click the plus sign and you you had the uh education level so once you are able to do that then you have your uh upwork account ready to send proposals so and um, how do you send proposal you send proposal with this available connect so if you don't have much available connect you can buy connect you can buy more connect so and how do you buy more connect this how you buy more connect so here you buy more connect here by clicking this buy connect if your connect is not much so you click buy connect here and we are using a free version and every month you'll be given 10 connect every every single month you'll be given 10 connect so because of your free plan so this so um based on other plans if you are running different plan if you want to run a different plan so this is a you can see these are the features of the basic plan so these are the features of the plus plan if you use 14 dollar to uh upgrade your account monthly and you get 80 connect monthly so and other features as well so we are not going to that we are using a free version so now if you want to buy more connect once you click buy my connect so we have different amount of uh connect so with different prices ratio of prices so as you can see 10 connect for plus one point one dollar and five cents so and um, 20 connects for three dollar 40 connects for six dollar 60 connects for nine dollar 80 connects for 12 dollar and 150 connects for 22 dollar and five cents so that's how it ranges so and um, you buy the connect once you choose your plan you buy the connect so now you can link your bank card yeah you can link your bank card to this uh payment provider and um, if you, if you don't want to withdraw the uh if you want to uh, buy this connect you can you have to link your bank card so once you link it the uh the money will be charged from your from your card so after li linking your card you can buy the connect as much as you want now if you want to withdraw now based on your earnings billing and earnings based on your billing and earnings so I have to pause this uh video now because of the battery is low. So I'm ending this video here. So see you in the next video.